As the middle child in Asus B550 lineup, the Asus Dev Gaming B550 Plus brings robustness, superior Ethernet, and a plethora of internal and external connections to the table, giving pricier boards like the MSI MPG X570 Gaming Plus a run for their money. It's noteworthy to mention the 8 Plus 2 DRMOS Power Stages VRM design, offering a substantial 400 amp supply to the CPU and SoC. This is more than enough even for higher tier processors. Added to this, it sports two sizable heat sinks and engineered with deep diagonal cuts, enhancing airflow and heat dispersion. The motherboard aligns with the B550 philosophy of less power consumption. It hosts one heat sink, each for the two supported M2 drives, providing ample cooling. It also offers two full-length slots for GPUs and three times one slots for expansion cards. The storage capacity is further expanded by six SATA ports. Design-wise, the tough B550 Plus is visually appealing with its black PCB, punctuated with yellow and white accents on the I.O. shroud and chipset heat sink. The addition of of a rich diagonal line pattern on the PCB offsets potential dullness due to component spacing. RGB lighting is minimal with a single strip under the PCB, but two regular and one ARGB headers cater for additional visual enhancements. With six dedicated cooling headers, managing the thermal environment won't be a problem. For connectivity, one USB 3.2 internal header is present, complemented with Thunderbolt support and a temperature sensor header for those who wish to keep a close eye on system temps. Overall, with a competitively priced feature set, the Asus Tough Gaming B550 Plus stands out as a cost-effective option without compromising on essential elements. In summary, what I like is the good value for money, the decent VRM design, and the great audio. On the downside, it might need to upgrade BIOS for Ryzen 5000 processors and no Wi-Fi. So what do you think? Is this the best motherboard for you, or do you think another board is better? Check another video where we reviewed the top three motherboards for Ryzen 5 5500 and see if any of these is a better option for you. Tell us in the comments below, and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Have an awesome day.